Hello everyone. How are you guys doing? Dr. Nana here again. On today's episode, I just want to continue from where I stopped the last time. You heard me. Since 2018, I have been sharing all of these things with my viewers. And one thing is sure is that I don't I don't eat your likes, so I don't even care about any of those things. I am doing what I am doing because that's what I believe. And now I want to start showing you the clips so you know exactly what I have been doing in a small skills. Because in life, I just realized many years ago, I realized that what is in it? Nothing. We are here. What we do here is what we leave after us when we eventually leave. We leave out our days. So it's important to recognize that. And the things that are happening in Nigeria, because most of my program is still out West Nigerians and other situations around the world. Somebody that is doing something that is right knows that what, what is they are doing is right. And when you are doing something that is wrong, you also really know that what you're doing is wrong. Why I talk about God most of the time these days is because we as Nigerians, we so believe in that. And I want to let you know, to continue in that route. Continue to trust God. There is no prayer that is unanswered in my view. But when that prayer is going to be answered, it's what we don't know, right? So, on today's episode, I just want to let you all know that there's no prayer that is unanswered. Every, every single prayer is answered. All right? So I want to share a video with you so you will understand why I speak or write the way I do about all these so-called GEOs in Nigeria and how we feel about how, how I feel about what is happening and how they take advantage of the the masses in Nigeria and nothing is changing things are moving from bad to worse so uh you're going to watch this okay tell to people outside she talk one thing we touch all of us me particularly why I choose her this first is because when I they do random attendance I they consider the disabled Now, should we allow that to continue? 
for me to be sharing this clip with you is for you to know that this man Berekete is doing more than all the GEOs put together all the things that he have done in Nigeria up until now this man is doing more than them he's better than them this is real life situation this is real life situation and he's solving the problem of we ordinary people in my view who is doing God's work is it this man or this person hold on That these people are doing is fake arranged the person that is truly doing god's work is people like barakata that is doing god's work i have been in this work for many 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 years the ordinary people and that's why god says that it's coming it's coming is he's, he's gonna put all of them to shame People who are stealing in the name of God. On today's episode, I want to remind my viewers that there is no prayer that is unanswered. God has a reason and when and how. He knows it all on when to answer prayers. So if you are not the greedy type 
and you are, if you're not the one that is looking for magic if you're looking for magic you can go to all those places where they display all this um, nonsense if you're looking for truly you want to serve God you have to know that it takes time serving God takes time you need to trust you need to believe in you to continue and in due season he will come to your aid I hope that I have showed you some of the clip which we continue to come then you can decide for yourself who is doing God's work if it's people like Berekete and people like us doing so many other things in many ways to touch people's life or it's all these GEOs that are flying jets all over the place and performing for the public so if you are that person who want performance you know what to do you know where if you have that person you have money to truly touch people's life and you don't know what to do look for people like Barakete and donate to them so they'll be able to know where those money should go to not people who are flying jets and for friends whether you support somebody you don't support anybody just know that there will be a time that you'll be in need so when you support someone know that you are only doing that in reservoir for yourself and that's why why i do what i do so i want to thank you all for listening and i want to remind you all today that there's no prayer that is unanswered god hears our prayers or induces he will show up